commercial more an option. Sorry about the banging. We have some construction. My husband's putting in a wood floor for us, so there's quite a bit of banging. Um, and I think that I definitely have the less exerted task this morning than he. All right, let's step touch. Keep those shoulders back. Keep the belly in. Good, we're gonna bring one heel forward, bending that support leg next. Heel comes forward. Pull the arms down. Keep those shoulders back, belly in. High knees are next. Hinge forward. Chest is up. We're hinging at the hips here. Here we go. Butt kickers. Opening up the chest at the same time. Pull the shoulders. Pull the elbows back. Good, step up nice and wide, hips across the plane. Your toe raises up off the floor. You're reaching up and over with the arm, palm is facing down. Shoulder is not coming up to your ear. You're raising your arm, but you're trying not to pull your shoulder up, okay? Think about keeping your neck long, keep, keeping your ear away from the shoulder, shoulder away from the ear. Last one here, legs are still. Pivot, so both your toes are facing one direction. Bend that forward knee, you're in a lunge. Lean into the lunge. Back heel can come up off the floor here. Good, hold this for three, two, one. Inhale, arms come overhead. Good, leaning back slightly. Exhale, arms come down. And we're gonna exhale and bring, inhale again. Exhale, bring one arm down the leg. Other arm comes up. Pull the shoulder back. Good. Hold here for three, two, one. Back up to standing. Pivot both your feet forward. So toes are pointed forward then. Pull them even further in. Arms come out to the side, palms start down. Turn them up and down, up and down. Good, interlace your hands behind your back. Pull your shoulders back. Take a deep breath in, exhale, roll forward. Let your arms come up behind your back here. Breathe in and out, in and out. Roll back up to standing, good. Bring one arm, one hand to either elbow. Inhale, exhale, roll forward. And we're going to make a pendulum from our upper body, breathing in and out of the nose while we're here. Good, in and out, in and out. Excellent. Stop your pendulum, still your pendulum. Let your arms come down to the floor. Let gravity pull your head and your arms forward. Good. Feel that deep stretch down the back of your legs. Good, we're gonna hold here for seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, inhale, roll up to standing. Bring your shoulders with you. Take a moment here. Okay, now pivot your feet the opposite direction. Bend that forward knee. Lean into the lunge. Good. Hold for three, two, one. Inhale, straighten the leg. Bring your arms overhead. Exhale, same arm as leg is gonna travel down the leg. Other arm will reach us up to the sky. Pull that shoulder to the back. Follow the hand with your eyes. 
Good. Inhale through the nose. Exhale. Inhale and exhale. Roll up to a standing position. Bring your feet a little bit closer together. Bend your knees. Hands come to the knees for cat cow. Round the back, look down. Arch the back, look up. Good. Round and look down. And arch and look up. Last time, round it down. And arch, roll up to standing. Good, bring those shoulders to the back. Let's circle the shoulders back for three. Two. One, you bring them forward. Three. Two. One. Good, we're ready to go. We are going to start with one leg deadlift. So, one weight, medium, heavy. I'm using an eight pound weight. So we're gonna be working balance and working our legs and butt here. So, I have my weight between my two hands. I'm gonna raise one leg. Okay, now I'm gonna roll forward just to the tops of my knees and roll back up. Good, you can keep a toe on the ground. You can put a toe down between each exercise and raise the leg each time, okay? Or you can keep the leg up the whole time. Here we go, it's nine. Eight. Seven. Six, five, four, keep those shoulders rolling back each time, three, two, and one. Good. Shake out that leg. Switch sides. Here we go. Roll down. For 10. Good. Nine, one side is always easier than the other. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Last one here, good. Weight goes down. Now, I'm gonna show you two ways of doing this next exercise. It's a lunge. You can do a static lunge for the whole exercise. So you have one leg step back, knees over the toe. You're in a lunge and you're gonna pulse and we're gonna punch our arms up as we pulse. If you want to make it more challenging, it's not going to be a static lunge. It will be a moving lunge. So your arms are going to punch. You're going to step back and bring the knee up. Back, bring the knee up. Okay, so a moving lunge. Just one leg. So decide for yourself if you want this to be a static or a moving lunge. Arms punch up either way. You're either pulsing or you're bringing that leg up knee comes up. One leg only. Here we go. Get your arms going and it's ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Switch sides. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, grab two weights. Back to our deadlift, we're gonna do it on two legs this time. Weights in the heels, arms are fully extended. Roll down and back up for 10. 
nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Weights go down, punching lunges, one leg at a time. Here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Switch legs, lunging. Opposite legs come back. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. One more round of deadlifts. Back to one legged deadlifts, one weight. Weight comes between your two hands. Back to our balance work. Lift that leg. Here we go. 10. Keep your eyes up. 9. 8. Good. 4 to go. 3. Keep going. Two. Last one. Good. Shake out that leg. Switch sides. Arm is fully extended. And down. Good. Down. Good. Keep going. Stay with it. You got this. Four more. Four. Three, two, the last one. Good. Weights go down. Last round of lunges with punches. Here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, switch legs, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, grab some water and we're on to the next exercises. We're doing lunges again, this time to the side. We're gonna do side lunges, and we're gonna do mountain climbers. For the mountain climbers, we'll use a chair. So you need two weights. One in either hand. We're gonna again do one side at a time. And again, you can either do these as a static lunge or as a moving lunge. So I'm gonna demonstrate both here. So static lunge. You'll step out into your lunge. The leg I stepped out onto is a bent leg. I'm going to bring that arm down, and then I'm going to straighten my leg, bring the arm up, down, and up, okay? So you are getting some arm work here, too. Moving lunge. Step out, arms come down, up, knee comes in, raise the knee, raise the arm overhead, okay? So that's the moving lunge. Choose one or the other. For the mountain climber, you all know how to do a mountain climber, but I'll do a quick demo. You can do this on the wall as well. The lower you go, the harder it is. So you can use the floor if you want it to be a big challenge. You can use the chair, you can use the counter. So hands come to your surface. You're in a plank position. So a line from your head down to your heels for a plank and pull those knees in so you're running and you're playing for the mountain climber, okay? So those are our two exercises. We're gonna do the 
and lunge on both sides, then the mountain climber. Here we go, pick up your weight. You're in a static or a moving lunge. Here we go, it's 10, nine, good. Stay with it, you got this. Keep going. It's four, three, keep your eyes up, chest is up, two, last one here, switch sides, let's go, 10, nine, keep going, stay in the game, Four to go, three, two, last one, weights go down, set up for your mountain climber, at a wall, at your counter, at a chair, or on your mat, find your plank position, and then let's Run in the plank for the mountain climber. So pull those knees up. You got it. Keep going. Push yourself. Come on. Quick pace. Four, three, two, one. Move away from your chair. Pick those weights back up. Just two rounds here, okay? So this is your last round of these side lunges. Pull the shoulders back, pull the belly in. Let's go, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale. Good, it's seven, six, five, exhale, inhale for four, three, two, and one, switch sides, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, good, eight, seven, Six, keep your chest up, keep your eyes up. Good. Four, three, two, last one here. Good. Weights go down. Set up for mountain climbers. Get ready, let's go. Knees come in, good. Four, three, two, and one. Very good. Push your chair aside, grab some water. Almost there, guys. We got some butt work coming up. So for this, you'll need your mat for the second exercise. So grab your mat now, and you'll need your band, and you'll need one heavy weight, if you've got it. The heaviest weight you have is down here. All right, so we're gonna start. You don't have to be on your mat for the start. You need your heavy weight, but you can have your band and mat out and ready. Heavy weight, oops, I'm a little off kilter here. Um, okay, heavy weight between two hands and between your legs. Step your legs out nice and wide. We're gonna do a smoother. 
I have both hands on the weight. My toes are pointed forward. I'm gonna bring the weight back, my knees are back. And then I'm gonna thrust my hips forward, pull the weight forward, okay? Comes back and forward. Have a nice solid grip on that weight, okay? Swinging it through. That's one. Two, weight goes down. Sit down on your mat. Put your band on your lower legs. You can double up your mat. You're gonna be in tabletop, so make sure you have a comfortable place for your knees, okay? I like it doubled up. My knees hurt when they're just on the ground. Okay, so double up that mat. Band is on the lower leg. Hands, fingers are spread out wide. Wrists are below the shoulders. Lift your feet and lower legs off the floor. Neck is neutral. Now pull your legs apart and bring them together. Pull apart, bring them together. My band is never without some resistance. So I'm increasing the resistance, I'm decreasing it, but it's still taut. Okay, so it's out together, out together. All right, so those are our two butt exercises. Swing throughs are first. So band will have to come off the legs for those. That's your built-in rest period. Okay. Boy, I am sweating like crazy here. Okay, we got 10 swing throughs. Grab your heavy weight. Make sure you're not gonna whack anything. And you're gonna keep a good hold on that weight. Here we go. It's 10. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Weight goes down. Get that band on your lower legs. Tabletop position. Check your form, get those wrists right below the shoulders, spread out your fingers, lift your lower leg, and pull apart for 20, 19, 18, 17, next day is neutral, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, keep going and going. Four, three, two, last one, good. Turn over, take the band off. Back to our swing throughs. Here we go, solid grip on that weight. It's 10, nine, hips come forward, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, weight goes down. Back to our bands. Work in the booty here. Okay. Tabletop position, check your form, wrist below shoulders, spread those fingers out for a nice solid base, and pull apart, good. Pull apart, pull apart. 17, 16, good, keep going. It's 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, last one here. Good. One more round. Swing throughs and then the pull aparts. And then we pull down. Get ready. 
Nice wide stance here. Good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, last one. Good. Weight goes down. Get that band on your lower leg. Okay, this is it. Tabletop position and pull it apart. Good. Pull it apart. 17, 16, 15. Good. Stay with it. Make sure you're in your right form. 10, 9, next day's neutral. 8, 7, 6, 5, you'll feel these. 4, 3, 2, and 1. Very good. Sit down on your mat. Take that band off. We're going to stay on our mats. Good. Turn around to your back. Let's start by making our bodies long. So stretch your arms up as high as they can go. Stretch your feet, your legs down. Good. Make yourself as long as possible. And now relax. And elongate your body. And relax. Good. Pull both knees into your chest. Good. Extend one leg. Cross the other leg over at the knee. So ankle crosses over the knee. Pull, uh, bend the lower leg. Put your hands just above the knee, behind the thigh, and pull that leg towards you. Good. And hold here for four, three, two, and one. We're going to reverse this figure four stretch. So opposite leg crosses over. Good. Hand comes behind and pull it in for four. Good. Three, two, one. Put both feet on the floor. Pull your knees in. Gently rock back and forth. Roll up to a standing, uh, a sitting position. Turn on your mat, put both your feet together for a butterfly stretch. Press your leg down into the floor. Good, sitting up nice and tall. Good, straighten out your legs. Deep breath in, arms come overhead. Exhale, collapse forward, reach for your toes and hold here. Breathing in and out. In and out. Deep inhale, arms come overhead. Relax your arms down to your sides. Find a comfortable seat. We're going to take a deep breath in together through the nose. And exhale. Excellent. Thank you very much. Lots of leg and butt work today. I hope you are all well. I'm going to stop the recording.